name's Ian Schneller, and I am the owner-operator of Specimen Guitar Shop and the Chicago School of Guitar Making. I have a new pair of horns here. They just got back off the road uh, from being on tour with Andrew Bird. It's, these are my two new uh, coaxial extra-large horns. And they're right here behind us. These have been on tour with Andrew for a couple weeks, uh, going around the country. Uh, as a so solo show, he's been using these two horns, the spinning Janus horn, and one of the, uh, the medium-large uh, regular horns. I, w I want to do a searching for uh, greater bass response and uh, more pr projection and more power. So these, uh, at a little over eight feet tall, these fit the bill. These are new, they're molded out of fiberglass, and so we can just bonk them down the runway. It's like a motorboat hull, sort of. They're durable, they're easier to transport because we don't need elaborate cases for them. Two of these horns nestle quite nicely into the bay, uh, cargo area, cargo bay of a Greyhound bus style tour vehicle. These designs fit in pretty well with, with his music right now, so it's a consortium, if you like. Yeah, I'm doing a, a variety of designs right now, so uh, the, the research continues, although these, these are specifically for Andrew. Depending on the way the drivers are set up, the function of the speaker can change. Uh, if it's a uh, a, a regular uh, guitar amp speaker, then it's, it's got a narrower frequency response and you can hit it with a, with a big square signal very, very hard and it will go into overdrive. Um, if you use a, a crossover and use a tweeter and a woofer uh, with the type of speakers that are normally used for high fidelity enclosures, then it's essentially a full range PA speaker. It can be used for playback or high fidelity listening. Bass uh, amplifiers uh, most people don't realize this, but the, pr the fundamental difference between a bass amp and a guitar amp is the type of driver that's applied. Um, in an acoustic guitar amp, they just add a little tweeter and it, instantly it's an acoustic guitar amp. So it's, uh, the drivers have a lot to do with the, the application. This particular pair has a coaxial set of eminence dr uh, drivers with a crossover and an, an attenuatable tweeter so I can dial in the amount of top end that, that I like. Andrew uses these, I believe he's using them to amplify his violin right now, so um, he's kind of crossing over the line there and using them as an acoustic uh, amplifier.